Hey everyone, and welcome back. And today we are looking at Monster High Skulltum and Secrets Series 4, Monster Mysteries. So these were at Target for $29.99. I was kind of shocked when I saw them. I didn't realize that they were going to be coming out so soon. Yeah. I was like, oh, what the heck? And they had everyone but Cleo. So I'm like, <laughs> this is an adult time for adult collectors. Um, but thankfully they had Draculaura. So let's just get into it. This has a completely redesigned, like, packaging, like, the whole works. There's only four characters, which is kind of pissing me off. Because, <laughs> like, when you look at Sculpt Music Grids, it's five for each line. And there's only four. I'm like, can they, they just, like, drop a secret character? Where's Skeleta? Wasn't Skeleta supposed to be in, a, like, a Sculpt Music Grids thing? Like, also, there's only four, and the main three aren't in it. Yeah, I was like, just give me Frankie. Just give me Frankie. Like... Just give me Frankie. Yeah. But we do have our second Abby. So we're going to be looking at Dracula. The most annoying part about this is you can see the doll. But you Not can't enough. see, the yeah, the doll. Like, yeah. I was, like, going through all of them, and I was like, I don't know. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I guess you. Mm -hmm. So let's, let's hope for the best. So here is the packaging. I don't think that there is water in this because it says solve, unlock, reveal. It doesn't seem to be a water play thing because I hate water play things. <laughs> um, here's the beautiful artwork. Then on the back again, there's the other four, the other three ghouls that are in this line. Here is Dracula's barcode. Um... I've seen a lot of people, we are in Southern California, and I've seen a lot of people from different parts of the country find these too. So they're part of like the new display at Target. How when you walk into like the doll section, there's like that huge mural of all the new dolls that are coming. Like they're part of that. So I'm like, how do I get that? <laughs> I think it's a picture of Claudine. So I'm just like, can you just make it Dracula? <laughs> okay, so oh, here's some stuff. Oh, it's pretty. It's hello? It's hello taken. Um, I have like fake nails right now and I can barely do anything. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so there's this cute key. It's really cute. Yeah, I, I love that. I was like, put that on a necklace, maybe. Coming for ever, ever after high. Yes, I love that. So I guess the things that we need are gonna be in here. Okay. Search for clues. Okay. I mean, you can kind of see what it is. So, what's that? Like a heart, another heart, and a fan? Uh, uh, the vampire heart. This is like a locket, I guess? A compact? Okay, well, what do I need to do that, though? Can I just... Like, search for hints. To do what, girl? Is there another way to open this? Am I crazy? Oh, here's like the back. That's literally all it's so cute. I love all the colors. This is like probably one of my favorite color schemes for Dracula thus far. I love it. It's like really, really like gilded and it's like shiny metallic. They're just yapping on it. Like, okay, why can't I just put it in? Yeah. Hello? What do you mean for clues? Um... I don't need to, thank you. Um, <laughs> let's just open this. <laughs> okay. But how do I open her? How do I get her out is... Oh, I could just open it like that, I guess. So let's get her things out first. Okay, so here's some more instructions. Let's see what it says. Okay. Okay. Um. Um. Okay. Perfect. Uh, <laughs> oh, cool. Love it. Uh, not sure. <laughs> I love when what are the clues? Like, what do you mean the clues? Like, okay. What do I? What do I do with the clues? Uh, where do I? Where do I put them? You know. What's the one? What's the one? Monster mystery. Yeah, monster mystery is, is like the subtitle for this is line. Secrets to have. Yeah. No. Neon frights. Neon frights, and then 
the other one. Fear doesn't. Fear doesn't, yes. So it's not the first, but like, what do I do with the clues? Yeah, what are they yapping about? What, what do I need the clue? Is this one of the clues? <laughs> I think so. Like, Wait, so is that one. What, what am I looking at right now? Oh, I love these gloves. Um, I love a plastic glove. Okay, so let me just start opening this stuff. Oh, two more. oh right, over there. Right. Yeah, okay. Sorry, this is our first <laughs> Monster Mysteries doll, and we're kind of confused by what the hell do we do with the clues? Like, what is the point of the clues? Yeah, let's see what the point of it was. This packaging is really cute, and it really reminds me of, like, um, when Michelle had the Disney Princess license, and they were making, like, their their pets. The Pals mm -hmm. pets. That's what it kind of gives me vibes of. Okay. Okay. A lot of stuff in here. Oh, cute. Oh my gosh. Y'all that have longer nails than this, how do you do anything? How do you do anything? Bless you. Um, I, I'm still failing to see what I need the clues for. Like, I actually have no idea. It was just like, find the clues. And it's like, for what though? Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm just you gonna just do. Pull that. Out. Yeah. Okay. okay. This isn't open. That just rises out. Okay, she's not terribly awful, so I guess I can live. What is that? There's a lot of pieces that she comes with that I am very confused by. Hold on, let me grab this rubber band. So she's like in the sleeve and you can just pull her out. She's super cute. She is very, very cute, but very, very poly. Oh no. Uh, no bangs, but her eyebrows look super eyebrow-y. Like, yeah. there's a lot of detail in her eyebrows. Her, her face is so cute. This is giving Lizzie hearts. Mm -hmm. No earrings, which, okay. <laughs> I like when they incorporate something like this and they have the earring to help keep that in mm. like the headset yeah. so here she is again i don't know what i'm supposed i don't think that you're supposed to do to open it because the whole thing's like a solid front plate yeah so i think that that's like the surprise mystery that she comes out from the top but like what are the clues for um that's like Okay, let's get... These are really confusing to me, actually. So, let's look at Draculara after we look at all her accessories. Uh, she does not come with a stand. So. So I can oh, yeah. Let me just put Drac over here in the corner. Um, she comes with this super cute pair of tights, which are part of her, like, main ensemble. Mm. Uh, so, you gotta take off her boots and put those tights yeah. on her boots back on? And then, yeah. <laughs> and then she comes with leg warmers. Which I think is part of her second look. And this pair of shorts. Those are cute. With a spiderwebbed heart right there. So that's for her second look. Um, unfortunately, she does not come with a second top. Is she not? So I'm going to have to figure something out. Because Dude, that's like kind of material. unacceptable. Yeah, it's a very... Yeah, they feel like a towel. Is this, like, what we're supposed to do? Like, build this? Okay, now what? What do, what do I do with this? Yeah. <laughs> oh, does it go in here? Like a lever? Oh. oh. Okay. That just kind of came to me. Um, not sure what this is. A little tiny coffin. Uh. Okay. Um. <laughs> I. Okay. I'm quite confused. Oh, right, let's look at her second pair of shoes. <sighs> These are kind of confusing. These shorts and light warmers are cute, though. I was like, what do we give her as a top? I don't know, but she looks pretty, like, comfy. Yeah. I'm sure I can find something. I love these shoes. Ooh, oh. Those are good. These look like... 
when you go to a theater, yeah, the curtains. Yes, Lady Gaga. Mm -hmm. That's okay. so much beautiful detail. Yeah. Love those. Like, super love those. Why is she wearing these with, like, gym shorts? Or the sleepy shorts? I don't know. I think she's supposed to be, like, practicing or something. Um, this thing? I'm not sure what it is. Maybe, like, a clip for her bag? Oh, yeah, I'm guessing. Her bag is super cute. The heart shape right there. I love it. Drac. Oh my god, look at this Drac. That's cute. And so much really fine sculpted details right there. I'm just paint it. Yeah, but at least it's this really pretty, like, holographic type plastic. Like, it has, like, tones when it's in the light. These shoes are great. I don't understand the little leg bars and the shorts. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I <laughs> wish... <laughs> Easy yeah, she's out. got no top in her second outfit. Uh, there's this thing. Oh, it's. I think it goes on her chest. Can I do her? Let me just, I guess, show her first. Okay. Like, so we can actually see her individual pieces. And um, maybe we can pause while I put, put those on so we can look for her top. Yeah. So here she is. Super cute. This is her... I think it's a one piece. Yeah. Ah. Um, this is super ill fitted on mine. Let me try to fix it a little bit, I guess. Okay. Oh, she does have the rib. Okay. I was like, I don't know if she's got the rib because usually Polly means no rib. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> she, this is like the same kind of pattern that's on this, mm -hmm. on her leotard. And it is super cute. It's got ribbon shoulder straps these are the main shoes i really like this a lot of people hate this kind of screen printed thing i'm i don't care mm -hmm. it's still printed i don't really mind this is a really nice heel too yeah the, the bow right oh, there they're super magical girl looking mm -hmm. and this is probably no iridescent mm -hmm. uh the best the second best maybe Drac from the Sculptima Secrets. Yeah, I think so. She's super cute. I just wish we would end this bullcrap of not being able to see our doll. $30 is a lot to pay for a doll that we don't, that we don't get to see. Yeah. yeah. So Tony's going to start dressing her. Uh, here is her like headset and her headphones or whatever. That's part of a crown. It's got cute little wings on the top, a crystal heart. Uh, I wish this was metallic, actually. And she comes with two super cute hangers. Not sure where I put them. Oh, is that what this is supposed to be? I'm like, you put it somewhere in here to make uh, a hanger? I don't know. This is super confusing because is it these instructions aren't instructioning. Is it that? Maybe again, I'm still very confused on what this is. Um, so I'm assuming that this can clip into the back over there, but I hate that this doesn't open. Yeah, like what the f? And then here is her brush. I love this. Please make it. It's so cute. And then her water bottle. Her hydro flask. Does it come off? Oh, no. It doesn't. Claudine's does on her hydro flask for her... What is it? Her beach doll or whatever? Uh, Scaravis? Yeah. Super cute. And then here's the chest piece. It's just a clip. And... She comes with these fingerless gloves, which are always a win in my book, especially if they're plastic. I hate the rainbow high ones that are fabric. Mm. Like it's not like she can bend her fingers, be serious. These are super cute. Love that. It's probably gonna be super annoying to put on them. Um, this, what are you? <laughs> A Genuinely very confused. So we're gonna get them dressed and stuff, and then maybe I can figure out what the hell I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> because 
What are you? <laughs> what what is this? I don't know. Okay, so we'll be right back. <laughs> okay, so I think we figured it out. So this goes here and it helps move this up and down. We've this was like a pole to put here for like her extra pieces, I guess. I guess. I don't know. Um when you move this up, that piece where I was like, what the hell are you? It's meant to help keep her in when she's in here. Like this. Like, so she doesn't, like, go forward, you know? If you're planning on displaying them that way, which I am not. And this goes up and down like that. So let's move this down. Oh, where did the stand go? Oh, she's on it. Okay. <laughs> And this little clip, so I'm gonna close this because that's how I want to display mine. And that goes, okay, that doesn't go all the way down. But this little clip has a heart, so you can put her right there. That doesn't look bad, actually. Um, and then you can display them on the outside of their box, which is kind of cool, I guess. She's levitating, but <laughs> I guess that makes her, like, really cool posing. Yeah. Like, that's super cute, actually. And then the second alpha pieces are on this track. This is from Fly Girl. Uh, yeah. Uh, her top. And I don't think it looks bad at all. So I'm going to give her the Hydro Flask. <laughs> Cause she's the one that's in rehearsal. Yep. I really, really love that shade of pink in her hair. Yeah. And I'm like, like raspberry yeah, I was like, well, maybe I need to go that pink. <laughs> it's not too far off from what I do. So, mm -hmm. so you can have your water bottle, your stupid ring stopping it. Show uh, the like wonders with the heels. It's kind of weird. I like it, I think, but it's, it's still kind of weird. Yeah. But here they are together. What do you think, Tony? I like is this it a, lot. a drag that you want to get? Yeah. Oh, we figured it out. This is a mic. Yeah. It's part of the mic. It's just not like in the picture at all, where it's like super close to her face. Mm -hmm. So it's just, we were very confused. I was like, what is this? Mm -hmm. And the instructions are instructioning. They are in the back. Because I was like, what the hell am I looking at, you know? Mm -hmm. The clue thing, I still don't get. <laughs> Find the I was like, I don't, I don't need it. I can just look at the pieces and be like, oh, this goes together. Yeah. I guess. I, I guess. Um. <laughs> okay. Well, hold on, we're gonna have a sheet like that. I know. Okay. Um. I still think she's one of the better uh Ultimate ones. Yeah. Because Neon Frights was kind of a flop. Yeah. And Series One, is still iconic, yeah. but That's I think it. yeah, iconic, but. Better dolls. Yeah, ha there's way better Draculars. But in terms of Skultimate Secrets, uh, Fear Dustin is still number one. And I think this is number two. I think so too. I really like her pieces. These are, hands down, some of the best Monster High tights of all time. They're if not cute. the best pair. They're very cute. They're very soft. And like, like the glittery detail right there is beautiful. So yeah, you're going to have to find a new top for her, which is kind of annoying because I wish that she just came with two outfits. Those tights on Skultimate. Uh, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> That's actually crazy. Uh, I might have her hold this later, like on display. So let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions. I think she's worth the $30. This huge thing being a weirdo stand is kind of interesting. Yeah. Um, She comes with a lot of things. Lots of things. Two pairs of shoes, like two bottoms. No top. No top, no top. which I still think is... Annoying because the other Sculptman Secrets did come with two complete outfits. Mm -hmm. So I also had to say, I have to say, uh, when I was putting the tights on her, um, they couldn't go over the leotard because they'd cover up some of the print and leotard. Mm -hmm. um, but because the skirt had the like underwear line yeah. to help that skirt not rise, um, <laughs> when, I, <laughs> when I put the tights underneath oh. the bodysuit after taking the bodysuit off to put, put it on, there was like a clear line underneath the bodysuit where the tights are. So we had to cut. Yeah, it really, stuff. it really misshaped her. She yeah. looked really weird. And I was she like, really it's so funny because she's got so many things, but she needs a necklace. Yeah. Like she needs something here. It's a lot of empty space. Mm -hmm. 
like maybe this could have clipped up here too. Like maybe they could have sculpted a necklace in. Yeah. Something should have been done here. This just looks very, very vacant mm -hmm. when you're looking at her. Because like, Most in, like, we have long necks. It's yeah. Like, okay, put something on it. In the artwork, you don't really notice it. And then when you start looking, you're like, oh, I kind of do. So, yeah. Also, I love the really high pigtails. Yeah. So let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions. And I think she's a 10 out of 10. Mm -hmm. But again, I will be called... Sorts, all sorts of things for just loving Monster High. <laughs> uh, objectively, maybe like a seven, but to me, she's a ten mm. because she does have flaws. But I don't care <laughs> <laughs> because I love her. Uh -huh. So let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.